I called you up, you hit me with the nonchalant thing I don't even think you want me But I could love you more Hey my honey doops, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys a new unit that I received from Her Given Hair. Shout out to Her Given Hair for sponsoring today's video. I think we can all come to a consensus that over the years, wigs are just constantly elevating. There, there's new different wigs and ways how you construct it how you can wear it i'm not gonna hold you i'm i've been getting the itch to wear some lace wigs lately but then i think about the maintenance and how much time it takes to put on the wig preserving it all those good things or all those uh tedious things but then i fall back on the idea and thought of well what's going to be convenient what's going to make things easier what, what can i put on and go you know without too much effort but still looking flawless that's where hair given hair steps in and this is their bye bye leave out thin part wig so if you have seen a few of my most recent wig videos i've been trying the v part wigs lately the u part wig and the they are a lot more manageable than a lace front wig. Wouldn't it be easier to have a wig that requires no leave out, but it still looks natural? So I feel like if it's no leave out and it looks natural, then you might think like, oh, an HD lace wig. But if you get up close and personal, you can still see the lace, if you know what I mean. I have been wanting to wear something that is just much more convenient. Doesn't take much time. Like you guys already know, I don't like dealing with my natural hair already as it is. So if I can have an alternative piece where I could just throw it on and and just go out the door that's what I want to do so when they reached out to me to try out this wig I was a little skeptical just because I'm always like thinking if I can't have any leave out with a natural wig then how like how am I going to make it look like believable you know but when I got the wig and I seen what I was working with I'm like I might be able to pull this off so I'm going to zoom in for you guys so you guys can see exactly what I'm talking about so this is their coily wig now they have coily curly kinky and the curly wig is more like 3b 3c curl coily is my hair texture that's like type 3c 4a and then kinky is like 4c and the coily is uh tight curls but if you look up close and personal there is no leave out i was kind of shook it when i put it on i'm like oh Wow, that looks pretty good. I will say for me, me personally, it was a learning curve because I've never worked with the unit like this. This is something completely new to me. Like it's easy to just slap out some leave out and call it a day and blend it in. But when you're working with a unit that is supposed to give you a natural parting area without any leave out, it's like, how am I gonna pull that off? Like how how is that gonna happen? It took a little bit of tweaking, but I was able to get it. So I did use some Edge Pro. I'm not gonna lie guys, my, my own hair is dirty so that's why it looks kind of build up you right here because i'm just putting like powder, powder, powder. i know i'm about to wash my hair today okay yeah i just wanted to show you guys how it looks so what i found that worked um the hair at the root of the wig is very bushy it's very you know like teeth and things like that and that's supposed to help with our own natural hair you know like i don't know about you guys but i have coily hair kinky coily hair so my hair is not like super sleek coming out of my scalp it's very coily Oily, very bushy very teased looking you know so that's why the hair looks the way it does so usually when I style like my kinky curly wigs if it's a lace wig I want it to look smooth coming out of the hair or out of the lace all the way down but for this particular wig it makes sense for it to look the way it does and it just makes things that much easier because if this hair was like super sleek coming out of the netting it would not it wouldn't work because it, just because of my hair texture it's just it just won't blend well because my like i said my roots are not super sleek they're very bushy um as far as the styling i use the dew mousse and i use some water and then i didn't even go too crazy with styling my hair i kind of just wanted to wet it i just wanted to basically get rid of the shipment type of hair you know like it's just like blah and that's how it looks i'll give you guys a 360 it's very full i told you guys i've always loved her given hair and you know the hair textures they provide i feel like they mimic natural hair extremely well again this is their bye bye leave out thin part wig this is my parting area okay the wig stops about right here and it 
ends right here. So it's a very small parting area. You don't need much. I feel like this unit would be perfect for those who suffer from like breakage or hair loss, things like that. As of lately, I've been suffering from a breakage alongside my hairline. And that's because if you guys follow me, you guys see that I always have my hair like in mini twist and passion twist, which I love. I love the hairstyle down. That's why I've been rocking it for over a year. What I've noticed is over time, it's caused a lot of breakage because when I do slip down my edges throughout my course of my protective style, all that buildup is getting into a twist that's at the front because that's where I'm putting the edge control. So I do wash my edges every single night, but I am constantly brushing it back. So it is being pushed up into that area. I just think the tension for long periods of time on the um, edge area is just not good because it, the, the edges are very fragile. It's kind of like baby hair. Like it's just very um, fragile. I can't think of any other words to describe it other than fragile. And I just think it's more prone to breakage if it's heavily manipulated and things like that so i think the overuse of product being in that area having you know basically a knot at the uh, root of the area for a long period of time has just caused breakage over time so that is the wig i absolutely love it if you are by chance interested and you want to check out this wig i will definitely leave a link in the description box below to this wig again thank you so much her given hair for sponsoring today's video i really really do appreciate it um, i hope you guys found this video helpful if you did please be sure to give me a big thumbs up let me know what other videos you want to see on my channel that's always helpful and i hope you guys have a great rest of your day and you guys stay blessed and highly favored i love you all so so much and i'll see you on the next one so until then peace two fingers